and the categories for this first round of play. Clues with the 2,000-year-old man. That's me. Okay, Thad. 2,000-year-old uh, man for two. All right, here we go. Of all the monarchs you've known, who was the most impressive? That's easy. It's this Russian empress who was born in 1729. She had such great legs. And boy, what a way with horses. Gordon. Who is Catherine? Yes, Catherine the Great. I'll take 2,000-year-old man for 400, please. What was one of your best times? One of my best times was sitting around with this guy in Venice. He'd tell me stories about going to China. And I'd say, don't mention the part about spaghetti and gunpowder. <laughs> they don't go good together. Gordon again. Who is Marco Polo? Correct. A thousand, please. Attila the Hun, was he really as rotten as they say? Rottener. You never addressed him by his three-word nickname. You always said, hey, you're looking good today. Hey, stuff like that. But you never called him by his three-word nickname. That's the clue. Three-word nickname. Dad. What is Scourge of God? That's right. 2,000-year-old uh, man for eight. What was your most annoying job? Well, I was a scrivener for this poet who couldn't spell. The first line of his prologue, he spells April like this, A-P-R-I-L-L-E. -L -L -E. That's, that's how he spelled April. <laughs> Jen? Who is Chaucer? Chaucer, yes. 2,000-year-old uh, man for 600. You have worked with some of our great presidents. Mm -hmm. Who were they? Go back to the first, Washington. He used to wear his wig, cockeye. I straightened him out. I straightened out his wooden teeth. But Wilson. Woodrow Wilson took my advice. I said, Woody, you're making too many points in this declaration. How many points do you really need? Dad? Was 14? 14 points, yes, indeed. And our thanks, of course, to Carl Reiner and Mel Brooks for helping us out on the program.